Good morning and welcome and welcome and welcome and welcome back. Y'all know who this is. It's your girl, D to the Y to the M to the O to the N to the D. You know who it is, and it's spelled diamond. Okay, so y'all. I look a mess. I'm um today I'm gonna be talking to y'all about where your girl be in it because your girl has been gone. Yeah, I know. Your girl has been gone for a minute because basically I had to do a lot of things in you know in life. So this gonna be like a little refreshing self-care um video slash telling y'all where I've been at. Okay, because like I said, your girl has been gone for a minute. And like I told y'all in the last video, y'all go check that last video out. Um, My day in life. Because that'll tell you some points why I've been gone. And then, yeah, it'll show you what I've been doing. Because you know your girl is moving again. Yes, I said that in the last video. Again, I'm moving again. Let me brush my teeth. Stay with me. them teeth clean y'all self-care is the best i'm talking about you gotta keep them teeth clean you hear me so y'all first off i'm gonna tell y'all um hello is the best toothpaste hands down hello is the best toothpaste y'all i'm trying to tell y'all this toothpaste work miracles okay So, um, let me tell y'all, first and foremost, I love y'all. I know y'all love me too. I love y'all more. I know y'all love me more. No, I'm just too <laughs> Y'all, thank you for all the, um, Instagram comments, DMs. Thank you. I said thank you. You're welcome. Okay. <laughs> I'm saying you're welcome for y'all. If y'all don't leave, you're welcome in the comments. Okay? So, drop down in the comments. Y'all, tell me what uh, uh, videos y'all want me to post next. So, I can get on with this video. Y'all, this is a 15-minute uh, hairstyle. It's a crochet or whatever. Um, but, basically, I came on this video basically to tell y'all where I've been to put all BS to the side and what I've been doing, y'all. Cause I told y'all I was gonna drop and tell y'all what I've been doing, how I've been doing. Y'all, life has been crazy. It's like when I say crazy, I mean it been here and there, there and here. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Then you you most definitely put a thumbs down down in the comments if you know what I'm saying. If you agree, here and there and there and there. All right. So, I had to take time out to get self back right because I had got into a distraction of letting social media really just bother me or whatever. Not bother me as in nothing bad, but bother me as in like I was spending too much time on social media, not even realizing what I, what is my purpose of life? What is what I'm trying to do in life? What's stopping me? Social media was stopping me. So, um, basically what I mean by social media is stopping me. I tell everybody this, if it ain't making you no coins, then why, why be on there? You know what I'm saying? It's more to life than just being on there on social media and you not doing nothing. Like, show your talent. So, basically what I've been doing is I've been writing down all my goals. I've been manifesting every day. I've been, like, praying every day. I've been doing that for two years now. I've been praying every day. I've been, like, doing so much, y'all. I've been trying to find me. I've been, I've been really trying to find me. So, I've been letting people out my life little by little. I have to make sure that my circle is good 
and the people that's basically hanging around me in my circle is good too like as in y'all on the same stream of life you know what i'm saying the strength the same levels of life that i'm on you know what i'm saying like if you're not on the same levels of life that i'm on there you know what i'm saying i don't care how long we've been friends it's a time for a change and it's a time to just like basically get you know if you want to stay at stand still, basically what I'm saying, I know I'm saying basically a lot, but if you want to stay on, on stand, stand still, then I can't fuck with you like that. You know what I'm saying? I can't, I can't be around a lot of people that just like want to party all the time or I, don't get me wrong. Do not get me wrong. It's okay to party. It's okay to go out. It's okay. You know what I'm saying? But just to do it constantly and you don't have no goals, no ambitions, no nothing, no nothing in life. Like I can't be on that level because it's just like I'm spending money, but I'm not making money. You know what I'm saying? I'm spending money, but I'm not making money. So it comes to a point in time in life you have to sit your ass down and be like, Diamond, girl, what are you doing? You was doing good. You was being consistent on YouTube. You were being consistent on TikTok. You were being consistent doing your business. You was promoting all the time. You know what I'm saying? You were doing what you needed to do. You know what I'm saying? You was taking your ass to your 9 to 5, 24. So where is the stop? What, 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 what's stopping you? The devil. You know what I'm saying? You wasn't worrying about nobody. You know what I'm saying? You wasn't worrying about people like saying crazy stuff, family, friends, it don't matter. You just put yourself on the spot. So it's like, basically how I can try to describe this is what I've been doing is like, so we had death in a family. It was, it was, it was, it was hard for a lot of our family, you know what I'm saying? And I give all praises to my, aunt, my auntie slash, slash cousin or whatever. She my cousin, but she's much older than me. So I look at her like, my auntie, you know what I'm saying? And I've been looking at her like my auntie for years. So she lost her only baby. You know, rest in heaven. Roger, I love you. Oh, whatever. This is him, y'all, right there. She lost her only baby. Good boy. You know what I'm saying? He's 17. So when I've been on this journey, y'all, basically, it's just like seeing people pass away at a young age and Family's going through so much, you know what I'm saying? Struggling, trying to get to what they need. It made me have to think that, like, you got children, you got a grandson. So you have to get, you have to do what you have to do to make sure that your children and your grandson is good, you know what I'm saying? So with me taking this path of my journey in life, I be alone sometimes, y'all. Like, I really be alone sometimes. And then I try to go make ends meet, you know what I'm saying, to make my life better. Because it's the fact that a lot of people hold grudges. And with those people, I'm just going to put this out there. A lot of people hold grudges. And when a lot of people hold grudges towards you and you try to make ends meet because they think about your past, you have to let them go. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter who it is. You got to let them go. Like, if you have peace in your life, basically, peace, okay? If you have peace in your life and you have these people that's not going, trying to even try to fix their life to go nowhere in life, you have to keep, you have to decide which way you want to go. You want to hold on to these people and try to make ends meet with these people or you want to just continue to have your peace in life and let go. Me? Y'all already know which way I'm going. I'm going to my peace because you have to understand that people don't want to be on the same road as you. And people can't leave the past where the past is at. And I'm not speaking of nobody because I have friends. I have family. I have associates, relationships, all that. So it's not, it's not towards nobody. It's just everybody is on the same sheet. And me, I'm the type of person that's like, I, I just single myself out. Like, I go to family functions. I enjoy my time, laugh, talk a little bit, drink a little bit. Yep, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, with the yeah. <laughs> but, but I don't smoke. 
don't smoke. I drink my wine. And I'm going to be honest. I do drink my wine. I'm 34. I'm going to drink my wine. And nobody can tell me I can. What, what is bad about that? But, because I know a lot of people look at my videos and be like, mm-hmm, yeah, she doing this, she doing that. Yes, we had a situation. So, somebody looked at my video and in person, they tried to tell me what I can and I can't do. Oh, your mama doing this, you know, and I'm baby, for real. I'm grown. I hold my own down. I pay my own bills. I do everything. I take care of my children and my grandson. So, I don't tell what I can and I can't do. But besides the big on the point. Yeah, so if you want peace in your life, you just, I, I meditate. I've been meditating every single day. Every morning when I get up, I meditate. I pray. I give all glory to God. I make sure that my energy is on like this positive energy. Like I don't want her no negativity. And that's what I have to tell my children. You, you, you come to my house. You, you do this, you know what I'm saying, you do that. When you wake up, wake up as a positive person. When you go out and you want to uh, be drummified and you want to hang around the wrong crew, it's going to lead you down to some, some bad stuff, period. Like, it, it will. More of the story is, so I'm about to get ready and move, right? I told y'all that on the last video. If y'all ain't saw the last video, then go check that out. Um... I've been gone, y'all. More of the story is, I don't have time for negativity. I don't have time for, like, a lot of people in my life telling me what I need. I'm 34. Telling me what, what what's good and what's not good. Or telling me what to say. Telling me what, you know, I, I don't like that. So, I took time to myself to act, talk to God. I took time to myself to be with self, to be like, you know, God, what, what is it that I'm doing wrong? I had to ask God, what is it that I'm doing wrong? You know, you're not supposed to ask God questions, but sometimes you have to ask God, God, what is it that I'm doing wrong? Like, what, what is it? You see, I'm up here changing. Two years straight, I've been at change. I've been at peace. I've been letting people out my life because uh, they want to sit here and tell me by me or they want to imagination. I mean, imagine that I said something or I'm doing this or I'm doing that. So it's just like, why? Like, why? Don't, if you don't come to me, come to me as a positive person. Don't come to me as, and I speak on positive a lot, a lot, a lot, y'all, because I used to be that girl. Used to be. That's what made me change. I used to be that girl. Be like, you know what I'm saying? I don't, you know, I used to be the girl that fight in the streets. I used to be the girl that, you know what I'm saying, want, want to be in a front with everybody because I felt like I was left out. You know what I'm saying? But sometimes you get to a place in life where you just say, okay, it is what it is. I'm not finna deal with that no more. Everybody's still on the same thing. God gave me talent. God gave me this. God gave me the strength and the ability to be different. I'm a very different breed. I'm a, I tell people that all the time. I am a different breed. I want more in life. I want to be successful. I want... You know what I'm saying? I want most stuff in life. Like, I don't want to be stuck in Texas, not doing nothing, not traveling. Don't get me wrong. Now, I travel. I might don't vlog it because at that midst of time, it's just like, man, like, I'm having the most, the time of my life. I might don't vlog or whatever. But I'm for the story. I'm for the story taking y'all with me on my journey because, like I told y'all, y'all are my real friends. I might don't see y'all in person. But one thing for sure, and two things I do know, like, y'all always pushing me. Y'all always motivating me. I don't care who y'all is or whatever, but y'all always motivate me, telling me, keep going, Diamond. Keep going. Keep doing this. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I do stuff for people like y'all. You know what I'm saying? I do stuff for people like that. And I appreciate people like that because at the end of the day, Y'all don't know me from Adam and Eve. That's one. We none of us, none, none, none of our YouTube friends. We we know each other from Adam and Eve. You know what I'm saying? So we gotta keep on motivating each other, showing each other like the world can be a better place if we just support each other. If we support each other and we keep motivating one another, telling each other to keep going, the world be a better place. You get what I'm saying? But a lot of people they don't. 
And they not. Because a lot of people greedy. Me? I'm not greedy. All thing I'm greedy on is helping others when they don't got nothing going for themselves. Or they, they want to be at standstill and they don't want to have nothing going on for themselves. Or, or stuff like that. So, that's probably the only thing I'm greedy on. So, yeah. that Basically, that's what I've been doing in my life, y'all. I've been getting myself together. Like I said, I've been shipping out orders. Right now, my Domo printer is all packed up and stuff. So, and all my products is packed up. So, I'm going to wait till I move to, you know, start back doing, having my business, my website and stuff back open because of the fact of, oh, I'm putting the wrong color. Y'all got me putting the wrong color. No, I don't put black on my eyes. My eyebrows. Um, yeah. I'm going to open back up my uh, website and stuff. Once my movement process, uh, I'm all moved in. Because that's always be, that always be the first thing I do is my business. That's my passion. So, y'all go hit me up on TikTok. Make sure y'all uh, subscribe. I really don't have much to talk about, y'all. My life has been amazing. Yeah, that's all I can say. It has been amazing because I, I can just really say when you put God first and you sit back and you start realizing stuff, and you just like what 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 is what is left? You know what I'm saying? What is left? Put God first. Yeah, like, your life can be amazing. That's me. Yes, I'm still a lesbian. Yes, I love women. But at the end of the day, he don't separate. He not gonna basically what I'm saying is he not gonna choose me out and count me out because I like women. He not going to forget about me because I like women. People say, oh, that's wrong. Oh, this, that, that. You know, change the lifestyle now. You know, I'm good. He know, he know what he put on this earth. He did. But other than that, y'all, I'm trying to come back consistent. I just want to tell y'all why I've been young. I've been on my self-care thing. I've been really doing me, to be honest. I've been really trying to get me together, you know, relationships. Yeah, I ain't with no relationships no more. I ain't gonna even lie. <laughs> no, but my uh, last relationship, she cool. Don't get me wrong. Out of my relationship, out of my past relationships. I can actually say that we are very, 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 very cool, y'all. It, it ain't no hard feelings, ain't no love lost with none of my relationships. It be, I ain't gonna lie, it be me. It be me. I want what I want, I like what I like, you know what I'm saying? If I see lack and stuff, then we'll talk about that on another video. It be me. And I don't care. You know, I, I want a lot in life and I don't see, if I don't see a person making effort to try to at least want a lot in life, then y'all got, got too much. I got too many goals. I got too many goals. My vision board is large as hell. So, it, it's just, I'm not going to say it absolutely be me because my ex is a tell you now. Not because you're right. I got to take time. They attack me in a minute like, it's they just tell me it's them. And I'm like, oh, it's me. <laughs> My attitude is like, woo! <laughs> and they be like, I mean, really, what's wrong with you? Nothing. They just like, they be like, you a goat. Yeah. I know. I know. I know. I know. I'm a goat. That's just me. That's me, y'all. If y'all knew my personality on the outside, you know what I'm saying? You'd be like, whoo, Lord. Damn. Slow down, honey. Slow down. Yeah, so like I was saying, y'all, get back on track. I had an important phone call. You just gotta um, <clears throat> put self first. I always put self first. Y'all, for real. I need to take all this stuff down. 
hell? Why am I up here using this? I told myself I'm gonna use this little pump up. I'm like, your girl lips are already big as hell. I told myself I was not gonna use no more that lip pump. Up. Cause them things, it really work. It little tingle in your lips, but it really work. Y'all, I'm not putting on no foundation or nothing like that. Do I need some? Yeah, it look like a little, 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 little white. I'm just gonna blend it in like this because I don't want no fan. I don't want no damn makeup on. I normally just do my dang on eyebrows in the morning times and call it a day. I'm gonna put that on there. Do my eyebrows in the morning time and call it a day. That's my little morning routine. That's it. That's all I do. Cause I'm about to get ready for work. Yeah. This is my morning routine, y'all. I gotta take all this stuff down. Y'all got my whole house packed and sell for this. My bathroom. Up. It's damn classy. Yay. I haven't got, I haven't took none of this stuff down. Lord knows. I have not. Like, this is too much. But, <clears throat> I haven't took none of that stuff down. I just, I'm working by little by little. I have took my mattresses down or whatever because I'm going to sell my bed. If y'all know, y'all know. Every year, when I move, y'all know I get new stuff. Period. So, so my room looking little basket over there. I just came from doing. I why well, didn't just came? Cause I got laundry in my house. Um, uh, I just did that laundry. Got my work clothes out. So, my bed. Did y'all stop me putting up last time, or did y'all? I don't know. I haven't put this stuff down yet. I gotta find. I think I had um. I think I had, uh, I think I packed the damn, the tools to the bed, but I know which box they in. I know which box they in, but y'all gotta take this bed down. I take that off my wall up there. Y'all remember that picture when I first bought it? It said, wake up to determination with one idea in mind. To be successful, to make it, to see progress, okay? To make it, to see progress, okay? Oh, I'm like, why is this thing shaking and vibrating? Oh, uh, let me start off. <laughs> Wake up with determination, with one idea in mind to be successful. To make it to see progress, to get closer to your goals, because the difference between your dreams and your reality, sharpness, the more you hustle and grind, your passion for action, stop waiting on luck and make your move. Yo, that is, I, when I wake up in the morning time, your girl be on knees. I really be on knees. I don't think I'm going to miss it, this view. Like the view here. When I wake up in the morning time, that's my view. Like, period. But better days are coming. Okay. My daughter, she ain't packed up nothing. When I tell you she ain't packed up nothing, yeah, her room is still done. This girl's room, this girl's room is still done. When I tell y'all, girl. Like, her room is still done. Now she, I taught her how to do color carnage type of stuff. Jeans, 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 she little teddy bears. Jeans, 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 she little little jeans like me. But yeah, her room is still done. Uh, I put my bed, I put my mattresses in my living room. So I sleep on my mattress in my living room. All this is, Basically, let me open up these curtains. Get a little light, get a little light. So, 
Mirrors down. All the pictures I had on my wall up there is down in the hallway. I think up still is the TV or whatever. King strolling, car seat right there. We took his other one over my cousin's, uh, not my cousin's, my niece's house or whatever because that's where my daughter be in mainly or whatever. And he go to daycare out there because my daughter's best friend. She's just like, no, he can go to daycare with me. I don't trust no daycare. So, yeah, he go to daycare out there in Dallas. Uh, yeah. So, all this stuff is packed up. I've been selling stuff. Y'all see my bed is back there or whatever because I put I brought my bed and stuff off in the living room and um kitchen everything is packed up in the kitchen y'all still for my food and stuff in the oven you see the boxes and stuff because the pants are still cool I take all that stuff down office area slash dining room Oh, wrong one. All my products and stuff, shipping boxes, all that stuff is just packed up, y'all. Everything is packed up. I listen to my computer, my desktop, uh, Mac is packed up. All this is packed. So, y'all know, can't use that computer. All this, my products and stuff. Those, my products, products, products. 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 Thumbnail. <laughs> y'all, I'm just living my best life. I ain't gonna even sit here and talk to y'all. Told y'all the other day, I had found the uh, charger to my, I met with and stuff. So, it's the only thing I use. My Apple Watch, my MacBook, my Apple phones, my iPhones. Can't use their computer over there. Y'all know I'm, I go Apple crazy. I go Apple crazy, y'all. Love it. Expensive, but I love it. <laughs> yeah, with the yeah, yeah. Okay. But this is basically what I've been doing, y'all. I really don't have nothing to talk about. This is basically what I've been doing. I've been packing, y'all. I've been trying to get my life together. I've been on this self-love journey, this self-care journey. I find when you get on that journey, it's just like another, it's, it's another feeling. It's another feeling of life, y'all. You got to get people out your circle. When you get those type of people out your circle, it's just like, man, it's just like a relief of life. Release a life. You got relief. You got relief of life. You know what I'm saying? And then try to... Uh, try to help others, but that ain't what it is. Y'all look at King. <laughs> look at baby King, y'all. He gets so big, y'all. He trying to crowd. Y'all ain't trying to crowd. Y'all know he been holding his own bottle. That's my Gigi, and that's my Gigi. He, uh, he's something else. That's my boy. That's my boy. But y'all, this is basically what I've been doing in life. Been meditating, praying, on a journey, staying away from negativity, doing me, living my best life. I'm not gonna say absolutely my best life, but I'm saying I'm living life. You know what I'm saying? I'm living the life that God has gave me. You know what I'm saying? Um Making it, y'all. Making it. You know, I have my goals, my vision boards, but just making it. Got things. The more of the stuff, y'all keep going, y'all. I really had nothing to talk about. And I hate that. But I hope y'all like, subscribe, and comment. Uh, I'm making another video when I get to work. I probably do a prank on my coworker. I don't know. It depends on who I'm working with. But I probably do a. a Shot, y'all put that in the comments. I'm gonna drop this video right now, so put that in the comments if y'all want to do a prank on my coworker. But I don't know what was having prank to do with my coworker. Period. What are they used to do? Hmm. Y'all have me think. Waiting, waiting. I don't know. I do a prank on her. It depends on who I work with, but if not, then I try to go to work. Y'all see me at work working my nine to five 
I work that. I work that job. Yeah, I'm working holly, y'all. And I don't. I don't got no bags. Bitch, I don't got no bags. Period. Baby, I work sixteen hours three days a week and eight hours the other four days. Maybe two. Add it up. Add it up. Add it up. Seven days a week, your girl hustle. Y'all got things to do. I'm trying to travel. Ugh, I ain't taking no travel because of COVID. I don't do nothing. Like, I got things to do. Ugh. Help. But yeah, I'm about to let y'all go. Y'all got to get ready for work. Um, I know a lot of people be looking at my videos like, what is she doing? What is she talking about? I'm talking to my, my real friends, first of all. I feel comfortable. I can vent to my real friends. If you don't like it, then boop. Go out there, though. Period. Because I know my real friends love me. Period. I'm just talking to them because I haven't been consistent. I'm trying to let them see the new me. The new improvement. The big energy. The big goals, baby. Y'all yeah, gotta run that dance so <laughs> I gotta run that dance so TikTok. <laughs> My ass always TikToking, but I don't know that dance. Everybody's like, like, baby, show me that dance so I can do something. You, no, this is <laughs> like, subscribe and comment, and I will holler at you later, later. Mm.